her. I think, you know, a lot of people know, you know, about, um, about uh, Harry Tubman or Grandma Moses and the Underground Railroad and her fearlessness there and her fierceness there um, and her, the, the, the effectiveness and accuracy, you know, of, of, of her navigation, you know, of those um, fugitive landscapes. But I, I, I don't know how much we know about um, Harriet Tubman as a root worker. Harriet Tubman was such a profound root worker uh, because obviously she had to be because people got sick and you can imagine the kinds of sicknesses that came also from having to live and camp out in swamps. But she was so well known for being a root worker that when um, the governor um, of South Carolina realized that a lot of the war was coming to South Carolina and to swamp conditions when he needed to set up um, uh, war hospitals, the name that was on everybody's lips in terms of someone who could be really an effective, uh, an effective um, healer or guardian of the or keeper of those spaces um, as a, a war nurse was Harry Tubman. And he wrote to Harry Tubman, mm -hmm. even though Harry Tubman, um, you know, wasn't literate. And even though he wrote to her at a time in South Carolina, where the harshest punishments according to the black coat laws for um for for black people and enslaved africans was that they be found either knowing to read or possessing reading material so he wrote to her at a time the governor wrote to her at a time in which the very letter that he sent to her was contraband and that someone a white person more most likely or someone who knew how to read would have to decode the letter for her which was also a punishable offense for white people one of the stiffest in the slave code laws is that white people be taught reading to or teaching um um uh, black people to read um um not reading to but teaching them to read reading to them with the intent that they would learn that those were stiff stiff punishments but he wrote to her despite all of that to ask that she report to South Carolina um to oversee some of the war hospitals that is how profound her skills as a root worker were so 